Hello everyone, hope you are doing good. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add products from Printify to Shopify. The first thing you want to do is create an account on Shopify which you can do for completely free. All you need is your email address, you don't need a credit card or anything like that. Once you have created your account on Shopify, you also want to open another tab and you are going to go on to Printify.com. Printify is a print-on-demand platform. So once on Printify.com, you'll go over to the top right-hand corner and you're going to see the option to sign up. You can also sign up on Printify for completely free. Once you have signed up to Printify, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. Once on this dashboard, all I want you to do is go over to the left-hand menu option and you're going to see my new store. You're going to tap right there. Then you're going to tap on add a new store. After you have tapped on add a new store, you're going to select Shopify. Once you have selected Shopify, you're going to go back into Shopify and you're going to tap on the left hand menu option right where you see online store. You're going to tap on view your online store. After you have tapped on view your online store, it is going to open up a new tab and all you'll need to do is copy your store URL. After you have copied your store URL, you are going to go back into Printify and you are going to paste it right here. Once you have pasted it here, you are going to tap on connect and then you are going to install the app. Once you have installed the app, as I have done earlier, you will be redirected to a dashboard just like this. Once on the Printify dashboard, what I want you to do next, just give it a few seconds to load up. What I want you to do is tap on Open Full Site. After you have tapped on Open Full Site, you will be redirected to this page. Let me go back right here. And you are going to go over to the left hand menu option once more and you are going to tap on my new store and you want to select my store. So you are going to select your store right there, your Shopify store. After you have done that, it is now time to create your first product. So to create your first product, again, you are going to tap on catalog. After you have tapped on catalog, you can select featured products or you can select any one of these categories that suits you. So I'll select featured products for this example. Then from here you can select t-shirt, sweatshirt, hoodie, whatever product you'd like to add your design to. And then you can select the design or the product better yet. After you have done that, you can scroll down and you're going to tap on start designing. After you have selected start designing, you can either choose to upload your design from your device. So if you had created your design in Canva or if you had paid a freelancer to create it, you could tap on my device and you could upload your design. If you want to use their AI image generator, which I will be using in this tutorial, you could do that or you could add a custom text. So I'll be using their AI image generator and you can select the type of image or style that you want. For this design, I'll be using a comic book style and you can type in the prompt that you want. So for example, I will choose a dog smiling. So let me type out that prompt. Then I'll tap on generate images. And by the way, you are given 15 free daily image attempts. So after you have tapped on generate image, you are going to give it a few seconds. Then from there, you are going to see the different prompts as you can see right here. And I'm going to be using this example. So I'll simply tap on it. After you have done that, you will see an example right here and you can simply increase the size by pulling on the edge of the box as you can see there. You can increase the size of the design. Then you're going to tap on save product in the bottom right hand corner. Once you have tapped on save product, you will be redirected to the mockup page. So you can choose the mockup that you would like to use. Then you're going to scroll down. 
you can edit the title and description if you want you can also add a size table if you want to the description and you can also choose to add tags if you want also then you are going to scroll down and from there you can choose the different excuse me the different variants that you want so the different size i'll tap on select all you can also choose your profit margin so if you like to increase the price you'll tap on edit price and you could set your price right here you could edit your profit or edit your profit margin it is automatically set at 40 percent so i will leave it as is once everything is there liking you can scroll down and from there you'll tap on publish in the bottom right hand corner once you have tapped on publish you will be redirected to this page and you can see that it is now publishing on your shopify store once you see published right here you can go onto your shopify store and you will see the item so let me go onto my shopify store real quick then you should go over to the left hand menu option tap on products and from there you will now see your design as you can see right here so if i were to tap on preview on online store you will see the design so just give it a few more seconds then once i refresh it once it is fully uploaded you will see the design and that's basically it just give it a few seconds to load up hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe and thank you again for watching